Hey everybody, Mark here at 8-Minute Axe. Today I'm going to play you five easy but awesome Beatles riffs and I'm going to show you how to play them. These riffs sound great, are really fun to play, and even if you just picked up the guitar, I promise you, you'll be able to learn them. That being said, whatever level player you are, it's well worth your time to take a few minutes and learn, or maybe in some cases, relearn these riffs. Sometimes in our quest to improve, we lose sight of why we picked up the guitar in the first place, and we've forgotten the simple joy of learning a cool riff. And let's face it, when you're asked to play something, you're gonna get a much better reaction if you play one of these riffs than you will if you show somebody how you just mastered the G sharp five sharp nine chord. If this is your first time tuning into the channel, welcome. If you're interested in winning a brand new Van Gogh 12 string guitar, I give one away every single month. Details on how to enter this month's contest are in the description. Let's start with the first Beatles riff that I ever learned. And again, I promise you, even if you've only been playing for a week, you will be able to get this one down today. That doesn't diminish how great it is though. Originally released as a double A side with We Can Work It Out, this was the Beatles' 10th consecutive number one hit, Day Tripper. I'm going to do a slow playthrough of each one at half speed with just the guitar isolated. I'll play it once with a click and once without the click. Next is a song that was originally recorded for the Yellow Submarine soundtrack. It may be unfamiliar to some of you, but this is probably my favorite Beatles guitar riff of all time, Hey Bulldog. The next one was the Beatles' 11th consecutive number one hit. This was also the last new song the Beatles played on their final tour in 1966, Paperback Writer. Next is a George Harrison pen song that was on the Revolver album. This is also a personal favorite, I Want to Tell You. The last song is one of the best-selling singles of all time in the UK. It's also one of the first songs to ever use feedback, I Feel Fine.
That's all I have for today. If you'd like printed copies of the tab or you need more help with any of these, please don't hesitate to contact me, markabernally at gmail.com. And everything on this channel is 100% free. Don't forget to like the video and leave a comment. And if you've made it this far, please consider subscribing if you haven't already. Most importantly though, have a great day. I'll see you in the next video.